Did you know that we have channel memberships now? If you'd like to help support this channel, get some exclusive Koabana emotes to use in the comments, as well as an exclusive badge by your name, click that join button now to find out more. Every bit of support really helps. Thanks guys. On January 7th, 2017, an open knee channel user started a thread with the title, The View From The Window In My Room. In it, he posted a single picture of a nondescript city landscape. That was it. In it, you can see a cloudy sky, various rooftops, and a temple in the background. Nothing terribly special. People post pictures to Nee Channel and its many variants like this all the time. Most don't gain traction because they're nothing more than a simple, often boring, picture. But as fate would have it, this was not to be the case this time around. This would turn into another legendary thread that people would remember for years to come. I know where you are, the first commenter replied. This was immediately followed by, I can see Matsuura Clinic on the sign in the background. I think we can expand our range from here. One must be shaking in his boots, replied another user, and others urged him to delete the picture. Of course, it was far too late for that, and from a single sign in the background, it appeared that numerous people had figured out exactly where the original poster was. You're all terrifying, one person replied, as various people narrowed down where the original poster had taken that photo from. And where was the photo taken from? Izuka City in Fukuoka Prefecture. Several people in the thread recognized the area, claiming to be locals. Yet another reminder that the anonymous Ni Channel forums are never really as small as you might think they are. You said room, so... It's not a house. Are you on holidays? Well, have fun, someone replied. Others continued to laugh at how ridiculously fast the location had been pinned down. The temple visible in the background turned out to be Myo Shoji in Izuka, which certainly helped narrow the location down. That's the Fukuso Inn. I wish I could go on a trip. How nice, one person replied seemingly narrowing the photo down to its exact location. More users took to Google Maps to prove how this answer was undoubtedly the correct one, using the rooftops to demonstrate that they matched the original photo exactly. What was little more than a photo of a city view had been narrowed down to its precise location in only 30 minutes. Yet despite the terrifying speed and accuracy with which users in the thread located the user's exact position, and various jokes about heading out to find him, the thread petered out quickly after that, and was seemingly done. It ended with a terrifying comment that most people seem to have missed. Hang on, that building is no longer in business. Seriously. Yes, as it turned out, the building that the users had tracked the original poster down to was actually abandoned, and had been for a long time. The Fukuso Inn was once a famous three-story building with 16 rooms that was often used by stars from the Kaho Theatre. However, by 2009, almost a decade before the thread was made, it had already closed down, although the building itself does still exist. The owner is said to live in the back of the building still, but the inn hasn't been in business for years. Over a year later, Someone seemingly remembered the thread and went to visit the building themselves. They replied on March 27th, 2018, with a photo confirming that the Fukuso Inn was indeed abandoned and not in business. So then, how did the original poster spend the night in an abandoned building with no public access? Did he stay in a ghost inn? Or was there a far more rational explanation afoot? The original poster never returned after sharing that initial image. That was the only post they ever made. Yet, a mystery was born. How did they get up there? What was the meaning behind the thread title? Did they really stay in an inn that had closed down nearly a decade earlier? At present, the building is still standing, and you can visit the area yourself in Google Maps to poke around and take a look at the outside, at the very least. 
According to locals, there is no public access to the remains of the inn, but that doesn't mean it's impossible to get inside, despite how it looks on the map. Part of the building is now run as a store, which you can see on the map here. Naturally, customers can come and go from this front part of the store as they please, but there is no access to the back, which presumably connects to the rest of the building, and would allow access to the upper floors, where the photo was taken. Meaning, the general public might not have access, but surely staff working at the store would. The exact window the photo was taken from can also be seen in Google Maps. By comparing the roofs to the photo, we can see the brown roof that is closest, followed by the black roof with the green part around it, meaning the photo could only have been taken from one of these two windows. The building is no longer an inn, and yet the person described the photo as the view from the window in my room. So how can we explain this? Well, public access might not be possible, but that doesn't mean that staff working at the store on floor level wouldn't have access to other parts of the building. And if the rumours are true that the owner still lives somewhere in the back, that means there are indeed ways in. The most likely and easily explainable answer is that a staff member went up there one day to take the photo, or potentially even a family member. Locals would remember that the building used to operate as an inn, and by claiming, this is a photo taken from my room, knowing that people would recognise the familiar Myoshoji temple in the background, and then put two and two together, an internet legend would be born, as indeed it was. Another option, of course, is that the building might be rented out, not just for the store on ground level, but perhaps old rooms inside it as well. The problem with this, however, is that there's no general access to get in or out of the building, which poses a whole variety of problems, and not just from a safety viewpoint. Is it possible that the owner of the building rented a room or two to people? Maybe, but often the easiest answer is also the correct one, and this adds a bunch of unnecessary complications. Who took the photo? We don't know, but judging from the information available, the most likely suspect is someone who worked at the store in the building and had access to the rooms behind it. Why did they take it? Again, nobody knows, but chances are high they knew people would recognise the area, as the location was pinpointed within half an hour of posting, and they would connect the dots. This is how the best internet legends are born, after all. At the end of the day, the where of this mystery is known, but not the why, or how. All we have are theories and possibilities. But what do you guys think about this one? Who could possibly have taken the photo, and perhaps more importantly, why did they share it where they did? Let me know what you think in the comments below, and I'll see you again next time.